Hi, we've got another story for you now. This one is called The Dragon and the Nibblesome Knight. This is also another one of my real favourite stories. I'll read a little bit of it, of it for you on the back for this one. It says, can knights and dragons ever be friends? When a strange looking creature splash lands in the lake, a kind young boy rushes to the rescue. But this is no ordinary boy. He's a knight in training. And the strange looking creature is a young dragon on his very first hunt to eat a nibblesome knight. The dragon and the nibblesome knight. I thought I'd show you this bit because it's really funny. Here it says, Professor Hardbottoms Academy for Young Knights. School Sports Day. Fight a real life dragon tomorrow. The dragons of dread were a terrible bunch. They ate boys for their breakfast and girls for their lunch. But their best thing of all, their favourite delights, were dribblesome, nibblesome, knobbly need night. When the smallest of all the dragons turned four, his parents said, Dram, you're a baby no more. This nest's getting all cramped and you've never once flown. Now go and bite a nibble some night of your own. So Dram stretched his little wings and he started to flap. But the lightning went flash and the thunder went clap. It hailed and it galed and the winds looped and curled and they whisked Dram away to the end of the world where he thumped and he bumped and he went bounce, clatter, crash and he fell into the lake with a fountainous splash. Now watching the skies by the edge of the shore was young James who had not seen a dragon before. And he cried, What was that? It's some rare kind of duck. It seems to be hurt. What to do? What bad luck. So he took off his armour and he said with a grin, I'm coming to help you. And he waded right in. A lad, what a dram. Well, he might taste all right, though my mum said I must nab a nibble some night. Oh, he stretched out a claw. <gasps> then he suddenly stopped. His leg was all bent and his paw simply flopped. Oh, ducky, cried James. Why, you poor injured thing. Sit yourself down and I'll make you a sling. That's better, thought Dram. Now I must find a bite of a dribblesome, nibblesome, knobbly need night. So he waved goodbye and he tried to breathe smoke. But all that came out was a hoarse kind of croak. <sighs> cried James as Dram struggled to roar. What strange sort of quack! Why, your throat must be sore. Come to the woods and I'll fetch you some honey. Um, it makes a good medicine, all soothing and runny. That's better, thought Dram. Now I must find a bite of a dribblesome, nibblesome, knobbly need night. So... He waved goodbye and he started to fly. <gasps> oh, his wings were too weak to take off in the sky. Oh, ducky, cried James. I'm so dreadfully rude. You must feel quite faint. Let me get you some food. <gasps> Come to the orchard. We'll soon fill our tums <gasps> full of pears and pink peaches and big Plums. 
That's better. Oh, you want to dram? Now, I must find a bite. Oh, but he fell fast asleep. In the new marbled lap. In the morning, Dram woke and said, Hey, I feel fine. Soon a bite of a nibblesome night will be mine. And he bellowed out billions of billowing flames. <gasps> then he thought, I'll say bye to that little lad James. So he strode down the road and he stomped through the field. <gasps> School sports day with special guests, the dragons of dread. <gasps> and there was young James with a sword and a shield. <gasps> you, you, you're a knight, shouted Dram. You're not simply a lad. <gasps> You're, you're a dragon, yelled James. You're all beastly and bad. Yes, muttered Dram. I, 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 I suppose I should bite. <gasps> oh, mumbled James. Then, then, then I, I, I guess I should fight. It must be all over. The finish. at once. <gasps> but I can't! You're my friend! My friend! Chortled James as he put down his sword. My friend! Shouted Dram and he smiled as he roared and they both gave each other a huge hug. The knights all said Dragons? Hmm! They're not simply beasts. The dragon said, Knights mm. aren't so nice for our feasts. Nibble at nights? Why, of course we do not. Though every so often they sort of forgot. 